Hey guys, make sure you stay until the end. There are a few hidden screws that if you don't unscrew them, you will break your central console. Stay with us, we'll explain where you can expect to find them. Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Volkswagen T1, that generation known as MK1. This is the first generation from year 2008 to year 2017. If you guys want to see how to remove central console, how to replace central console, guys, if you need to work on it, if you need to do anything like that, this is it right here, guys. This is the central console removed out of the vehicle. It's quite big, guys. Stay with us. We'll explain how we can do that step by step so you don't damage things because there are hidden screws that most of you may not even think about that. So guys before we start let us tell you a little bit about us. Every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos. Why? We take them completely apart. We show you how to do anything from uh, engines, transmissions, bodywork, electrical components, fuses. Why we guys do all that? Because our mission at the garage is to save you as much money as we can. All we need guys in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video. That way we can keep making these absolutely free videos for you. And for any of you that need to buy any parts, tools for your car at a really good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time. We'll put a link in the description of the video below. Check it out. You can save quite a bit of money. So guys, we'll demonstrate on that 2014 Volkswagen T1. This is the central console that we have removed here, guys, okay? Now, we will explain what needs to be done step by step. What we're doing, by the way, we're installing heated seats in that Volkswagen T1. For any of you trying to install heated seats in a vehicle that didn't have them, we have the video on the channel. You're going to have, okay, first the shifter here. What you need to do, you grab that one and you pull it out. It has two clips here, okay? two clips on this side and then this one with a plastic prying removal too guys okay we're going to pry that piece out it has four clips uh, six clips excuse me two on the back one on this side okay two on the front and one on the other side and that will be attached right here right so we have to do just pull it out underneath you have two screws hidden screws here then you're going to disconnect the wires disconnect the wire this one has only clips metal clips guys so you just go ahead and pry that one out and you need to disconnect that wire for the switch right here after that guys okay let's explain what else you have here guys okay so this is the central console once you remove all that stuff you will need to move the seat to where you can access two hidden screws on this side on the passenger side two hidden screws on the driver side just like that Next, you have guys, those are the two screws that we removed for the shifter. And underneath here, you're going to have one screw here, one on this side. Two hidden screws and towards the front in the upper corners, you have two more. And on each one of those, on the passenger and driver side, you're going to have one screw in one of these holes, guys. That you will need to remove as well. Then here, you need to disconnect the switch for the parking brake. And you need to disconnect your wires, but practically that's everything holding the center console in place. Hopefully guys, the video will be helpful. If you have any questions, let us know. Thank you for watching. See you next time. 